Good afternoon, Colorado. Welcome to Thursday edition of Local Biz Buzz. I'm your host, Larry Hers, and today in studio, making their third appearance and the first time ever to have somebody come one year, two year, three years in a row, we have Cassidy and Summer with Happy Bake Shop. Welcome. Thank Hello. you for having us. I mean, when I first started the show, like, uh, just amazing to get one person to come on and that you guys have been willing to come three years in a row. Same kind of idea to promote Valentine's Day. I'm honored, and hopefully we get to do it again next year. Uh, for people who don't know you guys at home, give them a little history of yourselves and Happy Bake Shop. Um, so we have been in business for about 15 years. Um, we are in the Highlands, um, right off of 32nd and Lowell. Um, we are Denver's first gourmet cupcake bakery, which is super awesome. I did not know that. Yeah. Um, yeah. And yourself personally, how long have you been there? Um, so I've been at Happy Bake Shop for almost two years now. So okay. I love it a lot. And um, I have been in the baking industry for about 10 to 12 years. So for a while. I'm sorry. That's <laughs> not possible. I can do math. You're like 24 years old. Oh, no. I'm 28. All right. <laughs> I knew you were young. So you yeah. started very young. Yes. I All right. Mine will make more sense. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. How long have you been in the industry? And for about sure. four years. Oh, okay. um, graduated with my culinary degree a couple years ago. Um, I've been at Happy Bake Shop for about two and a half years now. So, And it's really nice working in um, a women-owned bakery, especially since both of us are the managers now, trying to keep it women-owned, women-run, everything like that. So, yeah. So... Originally started, was it in a different location? Yes. we And were different further, owners, right? Yep. We were further down the street. Um, we were still on 32nd, but now we're in a location that gets us more foot traffic, which is really nice. And we have made connections with a bunch of our neighboring businesses, which is always great. Um, so that's always nice. But, it, yeah. It's a super cute store. And Mrs. Ocean Eats loves it. My, Mrs. Ocean Eats is <laughs> celiac. And they do unbelievable gluten-free stuff, including coffee cake, Yes. which you never see a gluten-free one of those. Yeah. I don't know how the heck you guys make that. We just started <laughs> doing it not that long ago, and that's been one of the biggest hits for everyone who's gluten-free. And then give them an idea of the other gluten-free stuff. I'm sure they're cupcakes, but then there were other things like bars, maybe? Yeah, we have got several bars that are um, gluten-free. Since we're not certified gluten-free facility, we do let everyone know that, of right. course. Um but we've got some like Rice Krispie tr uh, treat type desserts and stuff like that. And then we also have a few different cookies that are gluten free too. That's right. Yes. All right, let's start talking about ideas for Valentine's Day. I'm gonna just grab this whole thing and slide <laughs> it over and hopefully not drop it. Oh, you put it on, on the bricks. I see what you did there. Oh, this. Uh, we'll, we'll fix it later. Don't worry, we'll edit all that out. All right, what flavor we got there? Um, so that is our raspberry passion fruit cupcake. Um, it's a vanilla cake with a raspberry puree filling and then passion fruit buttercream. Fancy. <laughs> yes. I don't think I've heard of that one before. Is that a new flavor? Um, yeah. It's our classic, actually. Okay. Um, so that's our chocolate covered strawberry, our super delicious chocolate cupcake with strawberry buttercream, and then we dip it in a delicious ganache. I like it. And this guy? Um, that one's gonna be our red hot red velvet. Um, so it's gonna be our normal like red velvet cupcake, which is one of our best sellers. And then it has a spiced uh, cinnamon cream cheese buttercream. <laughs> We're getting moans, <laughs> yeah. getting moans from the cameraman. <laughs> I think that's a good sign. So are these available today? Uh, so we'll be starting those flavors tomorrow, okay. um, and then we also are just going to be doing all of our everyday flavors, and then we have specialty flavors for each day. So we're going to have tons of flavors in shop until Valentine's Day. And so Valentine's Day is on a Tuesday, and you're closed Monday. You're going to be open? Yeah. Uh, we're not going to be open that Monday, but we will be open um, on Tuesday at 11. Okay. This looks similar to last year. I think you brought me something like this. <laughs> Same cake decorators. <laughs> yeah. um, that is our carrot cake um, oh. that we put vanilla buttercream on top of. Um, you know, add some pink, red, some fun sprinkles to get in the mood. I wasn't going to cut it, but now that you said carrot cake, I might, I might be <laughs> cutting it and have a slice of the head in a few seconds. <laughs> yeah, carrot and red velvet are definitely like the top sellers, so had to give you some Here's good that. stuff. Are you making these too? 
Um, those are, uh, we got little uh, special Valentine's Day candles. How, what? Yeah. That's a candle? <laughs> How does that work? So there's the um, little wick on top and, you know, add a little heart to your cupcake or cake. Oh, nice I touch. see what you're going for there. Yeah. I was picturing it differently than that. <laughs> Not that smart. Oh, cute, 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 cute. Yeah, and then um, those are our cut sugar cookies. We do a ton of different shapes and um, like colors and stuff like that. A lot of people will place special orders for them. We'll have some in shop um, for Valentine's Day and then this whole weekend as well. We'll just have like little sweetheart kind of babe stuff like that written on the hearts, a little heart necklace or uh, heart sunglasses. Um, and just a couple other shapes as well. I love your cookies. You guys make really good cookies. <laughs> Thank oh. you. It's a balancing act. <laughs> and those are our um, French macarons. They are gluten free, um, but they do have um, almond flour that we make with them. So if you do have a nut allergy, um, that's something to stay away from. Um, but we have a lavender lemon, is um, which the, is the purple. Is that, yeah. The pink one is rose vanilla. The red one is going to be red velvet with cream cheese. And then the white one is uh, coconut with rum. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is going to be tough today. I want them all. What else do we got? Is that everything? We're Those covering? are all the goodies we yeah. brought with us. Yeah. All right. And what time do you guys open? We open at 11. Um, and then we're open until 6. Other than Sunday, we're open until 4. And uh, can people pre-order? Yes. Um, we love it when people pre-order, especially when they want dozens of cupcakes. We are happy to do that. Um, just give us a call. You can go online, email, come in. Uh, on the ways. website, can they actually yep. order? Yep. Yes. There is an uh, online ordering form. Um, they can walk in and place the order, kind of any way to go about it. Okay. And then besides for Valentine's Day, if people are looking for specialty cakes for weddings, bar mitzvahs, uh, how, yeah. how do they do that? And what yeah, kind of lead time um, do you need? And so pretty much, especially for weddings, we ask for as much time as you can give us. Um, we want to try and make sure your day is super special and exactly how you picture it. Um, actually, these cake stands are part of what we offer for some of our weddings. Um, you know, display your treats very nicely. Mm -hmm. um, and we, you know, reach out to the shop and we can get you in contact with our event coordinator. Can people just walk in and buy cakes? Are there ever cakes just sitting there, like for um, last minute people? Sometimes we do have um, like our four inch cake um, that we have available. Um, pretty much as we can get them out and as fast as people can buy them. But um, really we try and get two days notice um, to give you exactly what you're looking for. Great. Amy, we forget anything? That's it, sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> What's your website? Um, it's Happy Bake Shop Denver. <laughs> Happy Bake Shop Colorado. .com. Happy Bake Shop Colorado. .com. I'm not asking the phone number. Right? <laughs> I, it. Not a, I do have. I that. was like, actually, really? the phone. Yes. <laughs> well, nobody knows their phone numbers anymore. What's yes, the phone uh, number? Three zero three four seven seven three five five six. And it. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, that one we knew. <laughs> and if we're doing this show again next year. I hope you guys come back. Same. You never know. I mean, I certainly didn't think we'd still be doing it now. Uh, we will not be doing a show tomorrow, so everybody have a great weekend. We'll be back at this again next week. Tune in tomorrow night uh, around 4.20. I didn't make up the time of when I'm on this show. Everybody bust my about that. But uh, on CBS, uh, every Friday I have a segment. Uh, this week they followed me around to uh, while I was filming Restaurants Near Me Littleton. So I don't know how they're going to edit it and throw it on to the TV, but it will be on CBS around 4.20 tomorrow. Everybody have a great weekend. Let's eat. Mmm. Oh, that's the time. <laughs> that little spice is just... Right? Yeah. Brilliant. Yeah, so glad I can eat. <laughs>